Hello guys, today we are playing our first Scottish Cup game against Aberdeen, so let's get into it, let's cue that intro. Oh no, and welcome back to the Rangers career mode, and it's me Dan back again, and today we do face Aberdeen in the Scottish Cup. So just before we start, I just want to say thank you guys for the recent likes and comments recently, and I just want to say thank you to all new subscribers for subscribing, so thank you guys for that as well. And if you ain't yet hit that subscribe button, please hit that subscribe button as well, as it does really help. And don't forget to like the video as well. So thank you guys for that. So uh, if you didn't see the last episode, we did make some signings. Uh, so we brought in Julian Alvarez because we sold Alexander Isaac. Um, even though I didn't want to, um, it was hard not to accept the offer. So we brought in uh, Alvarez and we also brought in Delict, who is our new captain, apparently. So... Uh, yeah, let's see. So let's get straight into it. Let's go in against Aberdeen. Obviously, we're playing this game against Aberdeen because for some reason we keep drawing against them. So yeah. Um, so we obviously we're going to play our first uh, team against them, and hopefully um, we can you know get the free or well, get the uh, get past them, and then obviously get through to the next round. So that's the plan. So let's get into it. Let's play match then, shall we? Oh, great play. It's Paqueta, surely. Yes, there we go. 45th minute convenient goal, but we'll take it. It's 1-0. It's great play. Wait, what are they doing in the background there? <laughs> it's great play uh, from Alvarez and Edwards and uh, Paqueta. Paqueta makes the run into the box and he gets the goal. And we finally got the first goal. Uh, good play from Alvarez. And then, yeah, toe pokes it past the goalkeeper. And it's an easy finish in the end. So there we go. That's 1-0 in the snow. So there we go. <laughs> we'll take it. 1-0. Kubo! Oh, there we go. 2-0. <laughs> Kubo to po toe pokes it. Um, through the defender, I think. Um, I I think it was literally stretching for the ball, but we'll take it. It's 2-0 straight after half time. We've got the goal. Um, but let's just show you again. So Kubo's in that in that uh, in that bit, and then yeah, he just toe pokes it and somehow gets underneath the uh defender through the defender's legs, actually. But there we go. That's 2-0, and that should be us through, I think. Oh, good play to Alvarez. It's Alvarez, surely for his first goal, and it is. <laughs> I thought we went a bit too wide there, but he does get it. And there we go, 3-0, game over now. Um, I could I could have sweated it to, uh, towards Edwards, but in the end, we didn't. Uh, but there we go, 3-0. Definitely game over now. Just using his pace, gets past the defender. And then, yeah, uh, maybe the defender should be uh, getting that, or the defend uh, goalkeeper, sorry. Good finish underneath the arm. And there we go. That is, yes, 3-0. So there we go, 3-0. A good ball to the back post. And that is for Kubo's got his second. What a ball it was. I think it's Vita Roque with the cross. I'm pretty sure it is. But I saw the run at the back post. And you know what? I thought, you know what? Let's just go for the cross. Let's see what happens. Yeah, Jao Pedro, I don't know why the strikers, when you play the 4-3-3, doesn't go into the box sometimes. I need to have a look at that. But, um, yeah, good goal from Kubo. Maybe question marks over the goalkeeper again. Uh, but there we go. That is 4-0, and it's definitely game over now. And there we go. There's full time. And we do beat Aberdeen 4-0. A really good result, um, especially good to go beat them. As we haven't beaten them yet this season, so we had to beat them in the Cup. So, yeah, good 4-0 victory. Uh, good game for our new players as well. Alvarez had a good game. Uh, so did um, Delict at the back. At, at, 
be back because he's got a clean sheet, obviously. Um, but yeah, really good result. That's a great camera angle, isn't it? Um, but yeah, we'll take it. So 4 0, Kubo with two, Alvarez and Paqueta with the goal. So let's look at those match facts. Sorry, first. So 60 40, 10 shots to their one. Alvarez did get man of the match. No, Kubo did actually. Uh, so there we go. Kubo got man of the match. Um, so let's look at the highlights as well. So this uh, goalkeeper made a save here. Uh, this was uh, not Joel Linton. It was Paqueta. Good pass into him. And uh, yeah, that's a great save. That was just before half time, And then Alvarez had a chance. I thought this was going to be our first goal. Gets a bit of space. And then I just overpowered the shot. Uh, so he's unlucky there. But then Paqueta got the first goal. Great pass into him from Alvarez. And then, yeah, Paqueta, nice, easy finish. And then, obviously, Kubo got the second straight after halftime. Joel into, into him and then just toe pokes it, uh, goes into the goal. And then Julian Alvarez with the third to settle the game. All he had to do is finish it, and he does. And then, obviously, late on with a cross at the back post, Vita Roque with a great whipped cross to the back post. And, yeah, that was a nice finish from Kubo again. So there we go. 4-0, that'll do very nicely indeed. Hopefully we don't get Celtic in the next round um, because I've <laughs> played them too many times already. Um, I know we have got them coming up soon, so um, it doesn't really matter. But yeah, really good uh, performance from the uh, new guys. So yeah, we'll definitely take it. Right, so on to our next game, which is against Dundee. Um, we will put the second team out for this one. Um, I literally don't know if I've put the new players onto the second team. I don't think I have, actually. So let's just quickly have a look. Uh, no, we haven't. So we need to put Alvarez in and, yeah, Pedro Porro can stay there. Um, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, so let's save changes to that. And let's put that second team in against Dundee. So oh, let's do that. Uh, so, yeah, second team against Dundee. So can they beat Dundee? And they can. So there we go. 2-0. Hartman and Jao Pedro with the goal. Six shots, five on target. Two shots, two on target. So, yeah, 2-0. And it was Hartman who got man of the match. So there we go with nine rating. So we'll take that one. Right. So on to our next game. Uh, which is against... Is it against Ross County? Uh, or is it... I can't remember who it was. We'll, we'll soon find out, obviously, but let's see. Um, oh, no, so it's Johnston. That's who we're facing. Um, can we get any more five-star uh, thingies? We might be able to. Nope. we still just got the four-star players. That's annoying. Uh, right, anyway, let's advance towards the next game, which is against St. Johnston. So we shall do that game. Um, so let's do that. Uh, so, yeah, first team back in. Uh, so let's do that. So can we beat uh, St. Johnston? And we can. 3-1. Pedro Porro, Julian Al Oh, look at that. Julian Alvarez with two goals and Smith with another goal. But seven shots, seven on target, four shots, three on target, 53 to 47. And Julian Alvarez gets two goals and a 10 rating again in his second game. How about that, guys? That is really good from our new signing, new striker as well. Um, I didn't think he'd be scoring goals. I'm not going to lie to you. He's, I thought we, we kind of signed him because, he, he, you know, he's good on the ball. And, uh, yeah, he's got two goals. So there we go. We'll definitely take that. Right, we do have one message. Uh, show me that you need to play more, Raskin. Um, again, <laughs> it's gone up again. So let's see if we can get another five star. Nope, it's just, it's just, yeah, because people are going up in overall, isn't it? Um, right, anyway, let's advance towards our next game, which, or oh, we won't do that. Um, we do have to change Cooper's position because I didn't realise he was a right wing playing on the left wing. So there we go. And we'll put his... Uh, yeah, we'll do wide playmaker for him. Right, so let's go on to... Uh, let's go on to... Yeah, let's skip the deadline day, sorry. Oh, also, guys, I did sort out the uh, the contract as well. Um, I'd noticed just before we started the first... Well, before we started this episode, sorry... Um, you know, uh, that we had a couple of players who were 
who are on on poor and uh, first team contracts when they shouldn't have been. So yeah, I sorted that all out uh, just before. So yeah, really good. Right. Anyway, um, yeah, I don't know why it says new role for Kubo. He literally plays on the left wing. <laughs> What? <laughs> um, right, I think, I was going to say, I think we do have a... Oh, of course we've got them in the cup. Look, <laughs> what did I say? Let's avoid Celtic in the cup. Um, well, we might as well go up towards that game against Celtic then. Um, so let's do the pre-match report against Hearts. Um, so let's see if we can beat them. And then we'll do the Motherwell game with the second team. And then next time, we'll, we'll be back for the old firm in the cup this time. Um, so let's see. Um, right, so let's uh, do the kickoff against Hearts. And we are going to go in with the first team. So can we beat Hearts at their place? And we can. So there we go. 2-1. Kubo and Alvarez again with the goals. Seven shots, five on target. Three shots, three on target. 59-41. Devlin with our goal with their goal sorry as well 8.4 for kubo so he'll take that um but yeah it's another big three points so yeah we'll take that so now on to the last game of the day which will be against uh was it st mirren or i literally just had a look at the calendar i literally can't believe it was motherwell i knew it started with an m uh, Neves, uh, no, simple as that. Uh, show me that you need to play you. Right, let's advance towards that game against Motherwell. So we'll put the second team in because they are moaning that they're not playing. So we'll do that. Um, it wasn't, it wasn't a very nice offer for uh, Neves, but obviously we want to keep him. He's a wonder kid, so uh, we'll definitely keep him. Uh, so there we go. Right, so let's put that second team in to finish off. Can we beat Motherwell? And we're at home as well. So let's see if we can do that. Can we win? And we can. 1-0. We'll we'll, that'll do very nicely. 56-44. Six shots, five on target. Two shots, two on target. And it's an 8.7 for Jao Pedro. So he gets man of the match. Trubin gets an 8.6 as well. So there we go. Um, he wanted to play, and there we go. Wow, Livingston drew with Celtic. So there, we, there we go. There's that. Right, so, um, yeah, so next episode we'll have the cup game against Celtic. I might not play it. I'm not too sure. Um, let's see. Let's see. Because uh, we do have them again in the league soon, actually. Yeah, so we, uh, we're going to maybe play them there. But I'm, I don't know. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. Let's see. Right, anyway, guys, let's advance towards that game against Celtic. Uh, why do we keep getting offers for rejected? Um, well, yeah, I was going to say, why do we keep getting offers for players when it's in February? Um, right, anyway, let's advance towards the game against Celtic. And Raskin wants to play, really. Um... He's been feeling good recently. We've got bigger games coming up, Raskin. You can play the next game. How about that? Who do we play next? Uh, yeah, you can play the next game. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Anyway, guys, that is going to be it for today. So please like, comment, and subscribe, and I shall see you guys next time. So right, guys, I'm going. Bye.